Hey folks, how you doing today? Hope everybody's alright. Um, prepared for all the festivities at the start of the week. Um, <clears throat> I'm currently smoking an Aldo Morelli pipe that was gifted to me by uh, Pipe Puffer UK. And in it I'm smoking uh, Sangawith Cannon plug. Um, don't know if you'll be able to see that through the plastic. Nope, not going to focus. Either way, <coughs> quite a pleasant smoke. Um, I'm not sure that I get it again, but this was a block that was gifted to me by Piper John. So I'm enjoying what I'm smoking, but. You'll probably notice that the lights are not working on the tree. Um, basically the cable snapped on it, so I have no lights for it, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, <coughs> excuse me. This video is essentially just one to show you or tell you what my top blend discovery of 2018 has been. Now I know a fair few people have done a top fives um, and I did think about doing that but trying to narrow it down to just five was uh, not very easy when I was thinking about it so I what I decided to do was quite literally just give you my top blend um, you know, I mean, I have smoked a lot of very, very good tobaccos this year. Um, but my all-time favourite, um, that very quickly managed to find its way into a regular rotation, um, and I pretty much smoke it, if not every day, every other day. Um, it's an old blend. Uh, it's by Samuel Gowith, but... <laughs> <coughs> I believe originally it was uh, made by Ogden's, assuming that the blend is the same as it was back then. And it is Samuel Gowith's RB Plug, which is short for Red Breast Plug. Um, it's a Virginia, uh, Virginia Plug. I've seen somewhere mention that it's the... Um, same Virginias as the uh, full Virginia Flake. Um, I'm not sure on that 100%, but essentially it is an absolutely beautiful plug tobacco. Um, and as I say, it's a Virginia plug, but has the addition of Cheviot as the casing. And it just, the smell is really delicious. It has a very sweet smell to it. Almost a touch of gingerbread uh, type of flavour. And you do get that while you're smoking it as well. Um, it, it really is a stunning blend. It's quite a compressed plug, as you can see. It's quite a firm, solid plug. Um, but <coughs> it rubs out very, very well into a, almost into a fine shag. Uh, if you were to rub it out, um, it burns fantastically. It has a the most awesome room note I have ever smelt in a tobacco. It really does have a a sweet gingerbread uh, room note. Um, the the first time I smoked it, the following morning I came into the lounge and was just blown away by that room note. I could still smell it. It was uh, truly fantastic. <coughs> it's not a it's not a very strong tobacco, but it does have a full flavour. Uh, you know, it's not strong in terms of nicotine. Um, if you can get it, 
I, I really do recommend trying it. Um, and I think it's only available in the UK, but uh, I, I, you know, I've never seen it on a American sites or anything like that. Um, but it is one of those blends that I've got a reasonable amount in my uh, supplies. Although I w it will be one that I will definitely keep getting. Um, if I was only able to smoke two blends um, and no other tobaccos, Sam Gowith RB plug would be one of them and the other would be my own Casa Doom blend. Those two tobaccos just hit all the right spots for me. Uh, so yeah, Samuel Gowith RB plug. Um, you can't go wrong with it. Um, I hope you all have a fantastic Christmas and holiday season. Whatever you celebrate, whether it's Yule, Kwanzaa, uh, Christmas, you know, um, whatever it is, I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful time. Um, you folks take care and I will catch you all in my next video.